Our idea is to solve problem of uh, silicon being not flexible and being expensive. So we are developing new type of materials which are called uh, organic semiconductors. And based on these uh, materials we can make uh, thin and flexible solar cells like, like the one I show here. You can bend it and it's very light. You can roll it, cut any size or, uh, you want. You can cover your roof, you can make curtains or you can even make semi-transparent windows and many, many other applications. So our plan now is to file a patent and we're currently writing it and of course we want to we wanna publish papers. Right now we are thinking about small applications, for example, about covering of um, back of your cell phone with a uh, plastic solar cell so you can charge your cell phone under exposure to light. The competition enabled us to exchange our idea with other people and to get to know their ideas. Also, the whole staff from Innovation, they provided us with advices and uh, especially patenting services and, and how, to, how to file for these patents. My Innovation is the VibroWalk. It's a locomotive assistive device targeting patients suffering from peripheral neuropathy. And these patients have lost all sensations in their feet. So the VibroWalk is going to relay that lost sensations to another part of the body that still retains sensations. And it's going to do this through vibrational feedback. So the VibroWalk has two main components. One is a shoe insert that it has strategically placed pressure sensors. And the second component is an adjustable belt with a piezoelectric transducers that feed into vibrational motors. The next step for me would be to prototype the device and hopefully to do experimental data on it. Uh, and along the way, I would also like to get it patented as well. NYU Poly's I2E motivated me to take a simple idea to the next level and create a device. And now I'm on my way to making an official uh, you know, working prototype. Our idea is to recycle uh, copy paper in office or at home. And we are developing a special ink. Uh, this ink has very deep color, but uh, when you use it and print on a on piece of paper, uh, after that you expose it to some special gas, and this gas changes chemical structure of ink and it turns color from black to white and after that you can reuse, reuse your page. The next step is to improve uh, the chemistry behind the process, make it more efficient and faster and also uh, develop uh, more environmentally uh, friendly compounds and after that, we are planning to build a prototype, the actual device. I think innovation is very important for our engineering students. We shouldn't uh, be satisfied with uh, accepting the existing knowledge. We should develop our ideas, uh, seek the new things, and finally put them into the real, real world. This competition gave me a chance to, uh, to think idea carefully and uh, make it um, make it true. Um, let me feel I I can change the world one day. <laughs>